This is the Celtic Mist, the flagship of the Irish Well and Dolphin Group, and a part of a growing Irish marine research fleet. Dr Simon Barrow is here to take her on the last leg of the 2016 Whale and Dolphin Sanctuary Cruise, an expedition that began in May and has taken the steel hulled yacht some 800 miles around the Irish coastline. The expedition is celebrating the Irish Whale and Dolphin Sanctuary, which is 25 years old. The sanctuary covers Irish territorial waters and was set up by then Taoiseach Charles J. Hawhey. It was the first of its kind in Europe. This used to be his yacht. start of our last leg on the Sanctuary Tour. We left Glandor Harbour this morning. We're about five miles uh, south and we have fin whales, two fin whales, nice close to the boat and a small group of common dolphins. So a uh, great start to the last week and a great start to a lovely day on calm seas in West Cork. We have dolphins with them now. There's dolphins bow riding these animals now. Education is a big part of the group's work. The sea, the best classroom for volunteers and supporters. Research is a cornerstone of their work too, and they use every available technology. The advantage of the yacht is that um, once you switch the engine off and you put the sails up, it's very quiet and it gives the opportunity to listen for whales and dolphins. So we're towing a hydrophone at the back of Celtic Mist and we're listening to see what we can pick up. Now we won't pick up fin whales because they make very low frequency sound, but we would hear dolphins if they're around and we'd hear dolphins from a much further distance than we could see them. <laughs> 